Zamina Halani again, the card, but that he died again, the card. As she got children, but that's too much. Most of the elderly do not want to go to the revival churches, and she's therefore telling them that even though they don't want to come to the revival churches, they should know that the revival church will truly set you free. Around five to six years, I've been experiencing difficulty in breathing. So, my mother decided to take me to the hospital and they diagnosed me with asthma. So, when I went to the hospital, the doctors told me that that's something small, so when I'm growing up, it will start fading on its own. Which didn't really go away. So, they decided to give me asthmatic inhalers, which I'll be using each and every day. But they actually didn't work at home. So, every single day, like in a, at the hospital, we going four times. Where the doctors decided that they will want to put me at the oxygen machines that I'll be working with if the asthmatic inhalers are not working on me. And the doctors decided to bring me here. I didn't tell the man of God about my condition. I just started coming here every Sunday and receiving prayers. And by the grace of God, I received my deliverance and ever since last year of August until now I haven't used my asthmatic pumps. I have not been receiving any asthmatic attacks. Hallelujah, hallelujah. But after prayers, tell us how did you go about it? After the prayer, I was very confident. I, I, I must say that some of the subjects were really, really difficult. But this time I was not afraid. Hallelujah! Somebody rejoice in the Lord! Hallelujah! Somebody rejoice in the Lord! Our churches of Pentecostal Osiveva in my private parts where if I start itching 
have to take a net and a face cloth which is hard and then scratch myself with it after I scratch myself with it it gives me wounds so she said she doesn't remember the exact date, but in November she came she came here on one faithful Sunday. I received prayers from the apostle. After using the anointing water, only a few minutes passed by and that teaching disappeared. Hallelujah, hallelujah. I in my church I problem that I am a I am a I am a I I'll be dozing off. Since I went to high school, when I was at the primary school, I, I used to pass very well with, with, with good points, with good symbols. But just up to, up to when I went to high school, I'm no longer, my level of, of performance went down. So it, it affected me badly because it was shame to me. For at school, you used to be called at the assembly, people People know you very well that that person, uh -uh, that one can perform nicely. But I didn't know what happened. But by the grace of God, by his favor, by his allocation, he touched me through his servant whereby I'm no longer experiencing the dosing of Hallelujah, Hallelujah Somebody rejoice to the Lord I want to give glory to the name of Jesus Christ for what he has done in my life I was addicted to using cannabis I was into Rastafari. I believe that the Briale Selassie was Jesus Christ instead of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Believe who? Ethiopia, King of Kings, Ethiopia. Oh, Imperial, Imperial Haile Selassie. Yes, Haile Jesus Christ Oh, how do you used to worship him? I used to worship him through uh, incarnations, through smoking marijuana, uh, sometimes with other dreadlock rascals. But now you've tested both. Now tell us which one is the best. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Hallelujah! Clap your hands beautifully for Jesus Christ. I thank God very much. I've been strangled for 20 years. I've been experiencing strangling. Every time I'll be strangled a lot. I even went to witch doctors. And I also went to various churches. The Lord has really helped me through his servant Apostle Shonde. 
Because grandma is saying that they were all being strangled in the house for all those years and that spirit will come in the house and strangle them all but now it doesn't happen to either one of them anymore. After she was prayed for by Apostle Shambi. She said she has been struggled every day until she was so worried and concerned that she found herself even talking to herself when she's walking in the day until people started speculating that she might have a mental problem. How many days now without being struggled going on? Hallelujah! 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 Rejoice in the Lord! is saying that she no longer experiences that strangling and there is no more mo uh, strange movements in her house. The message is very clear that when you talk about Satan, you are talking about sin. When you talk about Satan, you talk about sin. Every time you sin, you are attracting Satan. When I went to Wabish Bay, we were told that uh, we no longer have work. And I was not in court in writing. I only found myself in January. I did not receive my salary. Then I said in February, I'll go to Wabish Bay. When I went to Wabish Bay, I came across this written communication. Yeah, they said he went to the company where he used to be working. Where I found this letter. Where I'm informed that my employment is terminated effective 31st December. Okay, and it's a bit like Africa. When Friday came, I went to that office again and I met, I went to the HR and he told me that at the press there is no employment for you here anymore that communication we gave you is clear 
you need the capital in on now. There is no employment for you here. Roma Gale, where are you going? On Saturday around 7 a.m. I took my phone. And the calendar and the a TikTok guy, uh, uh, Apostle Shombe. And I started uh, going through the TikTok of Apostle Shombe. And I remember that I had the prayer line number in my phone. I sent an SMS to that number. They pray for me for my employment to be restored unto me. They replied unto me that we will do so. So that Sunday passed by. On Monday, I checked on my phone. I found a payment of money deposited on my account of two months. January and February. Hallelujah! I was in trouble because I thought that was a, uh, they paid out my uh, leave days and I wanted to call the company and I wanted to call the company and my friends told me that if you call the company, you will wake up the sleeping dog and then they will remove the money they accidentally paid into your account. So I didn't do it, but on Tuesday I decided to call the human resource officer. Then I asked, what is the money that is deposited in my account for? He replied that that is your salary for January and February. So the HR officer uh, replied that uh, that is your salary for January and February. Right now, you are placed back on the system of the company. We don't know how that happened to them. However, we advise you to go back to Obama Land, but we will call you to come back once the work resumes. Whatever ritualists that is taking over your house, your business, your husband, your sisters, your children, your siblings, your parents, let them be arrested. Name of Jesus Christ. Be arrested now. I thank you for your grace to see the witches falling. I see demons falling. In the name of Jesus Christ, I see demons falling. Medinala Jesus Christ on Damona and Demonita de Willepo. Demons are falling. And the money that do we lepo. I see witches and witchy doctor. Falling. On Damona Lotin and do that do po. I see witches and witchy doctor. Falling in the name of Jesus. Damona and do not a lot of falling one of the Jesus Christ. Fighting Disconnected. 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 Your addiction. You hide the sin oh. in my body. Oh. In my heart. Oh. In my soul. Oh. Be disconnected. Be disconnected. 
disconnected. Shabon. From the color of my hair to the tool of my feet be restored be delivered be cleaned Hallelujah. 